what I'm doing to you now. I'm telling you just now to play it to be rich and real. Not just hard. Let's go. Can you hear me? Hello. Great. Let's take all. Good luck all. Hello all. Good luck all. And let's join. Okay. Okay. And play against. Play against. Against. Uh, t -t -t play against Bobber Aren Arena. Good luck. Play six is me if I'm correctly write your nickname. Mm-hmm. Let's see six. Okay, take this. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. D six. Okay. Okay. Take take. Oof! Did I blunder? Um. Take this this. Mhm. Mm okay. Maybe not completely losing, but not better. <laughs> mm, okay. Mhm. Mm Okay. Take, take. Mm hmm. Okay. Mm. We should be four kinny seven idea. Okay, mm -mm -mm. he, he doesn't have bishop a3, so let's try this. Mm -hmm. This. Um, ninety seven king of six. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, this. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Or E4. Or E4. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Mm, this segment is that. And I cannot take X. Um, mm hmm. Okay. Yeah. Um, guess I'll go for this then. To at least try to get something. <laughs> um, I'd say this. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm 
Oh wait, okay. I was planning that you'll go for it. <laughs> yeah, you just blundered a bishop. Um yes, I'll just take. Nice. Rook eight is not good, but this is, seems good. Yeah. This. Mm -hmm. And yeah. And on the Bobber Arena. Please excuse me if I not correctly write your nickname. La la la. Ba -da -ba -ba. Well, let's see how oh, is it in Magnus Wesley finals? Okay, they got a draw. Timur against MV also got a draw. Hey, Magnus played this is weirdly and this is a draw. Oh, that's super weird. Play against Nishmaster M. Koganov. Yeah, it was worse, but. At some point I get lucky. Um. Okay. Oh, uh, it's not a disaster. I guess I can take these. Mm -hmm. Bishop e3. Castle H3 mm -hmm. Rook C1 Okay Uh-huh Mm-hmm Ninety-five B3. So no, ninety-four is not an idea, or not a threat at least. Um, here I was planning to do something like this. If H6, I guess I can come back. Maybe I don't need to. Yeah, I don't know though. This is possible, but probably if I want this, then let's go king h1. So knight c6, I can take knight c6 because if I play f4 immediately, then knight c6 and I'm pinned. So, so yeah. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> he plays knight c6. Uh, boom, e4, we have takes e. Um, Boom. Okay, ninety six. I have to take C three, I guess. Mm -hmm. Okay, H six. Yep. Idea. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Uh -huh. Um I mean that doesn't look bad. No queen d four Siri tanks. Ah, yes this um should be five years queen of seven at the end. Mm, queen d2, queen c3, queen e2. No, queen d1, which should be five threats. Mm -hmm. But he has ten points already. Okay. <laughs> Rookie one. Wait. Mm, yeah, that's true. Now he retains. Uh, I mean, king g1, queen e2, queen d4. 
Probably that's what I will play. Ah, just for trade. Um, a4. Rook d3. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let's do this. Ninety four bishop d three. Yep. A take King G two. Boom. Okay, uh, yeah. Got his position calculations, but here I guess I can flag him. Mm, okay, shade. Boom. Let's say C, skin of 70 years. Check. Okay, so I don't have C's then. Okay, no one the name is Master Koganov. Good game. So, Magnus Wesley, weird game. Real Taymor. Probably Taymor can win this. Um, yeah. Interesting. Yeah, okay, previous game probably I didn't play it. Ideally, but I can play in Sensor Master J Cross over. Um, okay. Uh -huh. Boom. This. Five. Maybe I'm playing too creatively. I don't know. Okay, I thought he'll go for an five. Take, take, and then take, take, and then um, I d5. I have to play, but okay. We should be five in this position, but okay, he didn't want it. Okay, and I d5 now, and knight c4. I b takes c. But yes, so this. This at some point and this. What if I do that? Um, queen e four, knight c three, queen b two, c three, knight queen d one, knight c three. Okay, he, he sacrifices the exchange. Ah, I see. Boom, 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 boom. This. Queen e7, bishop a3, knight d3, yes, knight c4, um, knight a6, they don't want, yeah, maybe knight a6, c5. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, I guess c5. Let's continue my plan. Mm -hmm. uh, it should be 7. Oh, trap. Um, trap, but I guess I can protect from it quite, quite simply. This I'll take, I'll play knight c5, I'll take, I'll uh, play this or that, or queen d5, or h6, I have many moves though, um, probably queen d3, boom, queen c1 I'm gonna do, probably h6 or queen d, oh wait, queen d5, ah wait, but okay, here I have trait, aren't I, yes, it's trait, now I'm gonna just go for h6, Knight a4, b4, mm -hmm. ah, wait, to be careful, 
Um, C397. I mean, maybe not a, the end of the world, but still. Okay, yes, let's play this. Mm -hmm. Hope that I don't blunder anything. Now this. C3, C2 idea. P3. Ah, wait, this is an idea. It's actually sneaky. Maybe I'll go for C6. Here it should be protected. These squares are protected also. C3, Bishop, yeah, C3 is, enough. is fine. Um okay, nice. A win nice nice. Maybe it takes it was better. And what diminished master J cross over Hello no, I'm here. Yeah, so Magnus Wesley they have some spicy games. First one was quite in the ah, okay. So the agreed and draw here. Oops. You see nah, I mean there was maybe not that spicy. Magnus tried, but okay. Um, play against Karaki, Karaki, Todella, BAP. Okay, playing against first place. Good luck. He's from France. Okay. Um, Uh huh. It's like this, I see. Go for this, this. Mm hmm. Take. Uh, boom. Mm hmm. Three. This boom. Um, let's do this. Take okay, probably not the dreamiest position you could ever get. Uh, now let's play a bit more. Five, I have played four at some point, I guess. Maybe I can do something like that. Yeah. Maybe I cannot do something like that. I mean, maybe this is quite possible. Yeah, maybe. Okay, let's say four. I mean, okay, my idea is maybe to put king. If he doesn't play five, if he play, uh, no, if he plays a five, if he does not, then b4 um, immediately. Okay, yes, I, I'll go for that. And maybe he'll play c5. Okay, if he plays so, his bishop can be somewhat stuck, I guess. Um, yeah, he plays it. Um, Hmm. Have this, but then bishop g4 and it can get a bit combat. Uh, mm, king d1, king c2. Aha, uh -huh, so he. Yeah, okay, and then, and then I guess he'll go for b6, right? Mm, yeah. Okay, so bishop is stuck there. Mm, probably forever. Um, I'll play aggressive. Well, Opposite side. See if he'll take. No, he doesn't. He does not take. S5 is okay, but he he'll play g5, I guess. I'll play bishop e2, then bishop h5, king e3. I'm gonna try still. Probably won't work. Still, it's worth a try, I guess. Um, Let's put bishop here, now king there, g, this, this. Wait, but then I can trap my bishop like he did with his, with his bishop. Uh -huh. Okay, so he wants to trade. Now let's keep them. Okay, h4, h5. 
Yes, no, he does not play so. As G4 and L try four, but he'll play H6. Yes, and uh, that's a draw. Um, uh, make a move. I mean, let's see. Um, can I? No, I cannot play and win. So okay, and another game. Crocky Todella B A P. Good game. In crossover, I played one nil nil against J crossover. Okay. Oh, now Magnus is better. That's weird. What is that? No, knight c5, bishop e5. That's crazy. Wait, yo, yo, I can play against a world champion. Mm hmm. Okay. Ah. Um, wait, I guess here this doesn't hurt, so probably queen a4 is my move. Mm -hmm. Okay, so here d takes c, if I remember everything correctly. I guess it's take, we should be four. That's not bad. Take, take. Castle, now we have d1. We should be six, queen b5. Or maybe queen c3. Um, let's try. Queen c3, queen d5, that's what I don't really like. Or queen c2. Win B five. Maybe I'm going a bit too too far away. Let's see. Yeah, maybe it's maybe it's a bit too much, but let's see. Um Queen A four. Mm-hmm. I'd say this is g5. <laughs> yep. Mm hmm, h6. Um, okay, ninety-four. Take. Take five or no, we should be two. Okay, under the pawn. Uh huh. Oops. It's right to be trappy. This is threat, and this maybe maybe he will, can think that the eighty five is threat. <laughs> okay, most most bigger bigger trap is b three. <laughs> yep. Mm -hmm. Yes, he sees it right. Let's still play trappy. This. <laughs> Okay. Should be three. I'll go for this. Some more traps are here. <laughs> um. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. my tail go e3. Not sure if that's good though. <laughs> but okay, I guess I am not better here, so I guess if for a slightly worse position I get lose it, it's not a disaster. Yeah, if I was winning, then it would have been still not a disaster, but not the nicest thing. Okay, boom. Mm 
boom. Okay, it's that one I'll play with a bit less of comments. Take. Yes, yes, you go for that though. Mm -hmm. Not sync. No. I won't trade. Oh, I could have take. <laughs> oh, but I still take. I'll still take. Um, only on E5, I would like a bit more. This other one. Okay, interest removal. No stuff one. Okay, I guess if I didn't hang uh, bishop, probably I guess I would have not win. The user must have been a factor. No, today it's quite popular. Uh, <laughs> um, okay. Boom. Um, yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'll take this. Okay. Um, doesn't take. Let's do this. Um, this, this. I should say 3 and 84. Maybe that's too greedy, but I'll try. Yeah. Let's try. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Mm, rookie eight. Yeah, I was thinking d5, but then I saw that he has bishop of eight, he takes c knight to six. So, yeah, he didn't play it. I might guess he'll take on f7 or play something aggressive. Not sure, but I guess. Yep, queen h5. I guess queen h5, I can put them. I can put this move to aggressive type of moves. If knight e5, I have g6. Um, most looks cool. I mean, I have d5 also, but then d5, bishop d5, g6, bishop f7, he has, and king f7, this doesn't look cool. Um, at least in my point of view, um, this, yes. Yeah, maybe I was. Win somehow here, but I'll go knight e5. So g6 idea, some, yeah, probably d5 maybe could give me a faster win if, if yeah, <laughs> I don't know if I'll win here, but I'll try. Maybe there, right? I win <laughs> if I don't have it here, uh, but still, I didn't like bishop d5 there. So, what do we have here? That goes for this. No bishop g4. <laughs> Traps. <laughs> Traps are everywhere. Okay, he prevents. 
Um, he doesn't fall into this trap. I'll still play g6. Yeah, queen h6. Um, queen g5, I can go for a trade. Yes, that and I'll play with a bit of less of comments because I'm again super slow. Yeah. Okay. It's not super okay because I'm so short on time. Okay, here it's queen trade. Six, yeah. Oops. Whoa, okay, the little finger must be a factor. Yeah, there was a draw, but I, I, I was too slow full game. Yeah, I got a draw, but <laughs> I was snailed. <laughs> okay. Good game. Yeah, and I, I didn't, when I was snail, I didn't play good. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So Magnus probably gonna win this. Not sure. So Tamor is drawish. I'm playing Sneak Eater Lebedev 2005. Yeah, previous game, I guess I was maybe not winning at the opening. But at least drawish. At the end, I was completely drawish, but I was completely <laughs> slowish also. And yeah, just in that time and we want to trade to a Rukan game. Um, yep. Yeah. Oh, wait, what do I do? <laughs> well, um, but okay, let's. What? What? Okay, how much times did I try it? Lol. Yeah, in the game against Benefactor, it also was like. I three or times, four times tried to play King move, but it didn't work. A bit weird also. Uh, boom. Let's think. This, this. Let's not think a lot, though. <laughs> Just a little bit. <laughs> Ten minutes later. Uh, one more second, one more second. I, I can't wait. <laughs> very important. Very important. <laughs> okay, let's take with King. Queen C to Rook C6 is idea. He has King H8 and he can just relax there. So, <laughs> so yeah. But okay, at least got two pawns. Um, um 93. 
87 probably. Be careful with mates, right? It's extra. D7? Yes. Mm -hmm. Um, boom, boom, Rook D1. What should I do? Yes, I'll take. Maybe that's not good because I'm done the material, but I like it at least. <laughs> okay. H4. Oh, wait, something. I don't like something like Rook C. Ah, okay, he goes for this. Uh, check, I have to be careful though. Um, um, bum 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 What about this? Yes, Queen D7. Maybe not it, but then I have B. If Queen D7, then I guess I have B3. Mm hmm. I mean, okay, then here B3, I guess, because otherwise it's a bit too, I don't know how to say, a bit uncomfortable, at least for me, but I'm playing with white, so I guess it should be more comfortable for me. <laughs> okay, so, Queen B7, no, Queen D7, I thought maybe Queen B7, but okay, here I'll go D6 and then on maximum, oh wait, I have to be maximum careful also. Knight e5 is somewhat idea, I guess. Oh, wait, is this a blunder of knight e5? It's queen b5, d7, take, take. Is this a blunder? That's a question. Question. Hmm. Boom. I mean, okay, I'll go. It didn't, doesn't seem that I lose immediately. d7. Um, let's try. Okay, he takes, I'll take of course. Um, now I should be careful because GF that doesn't look bad and doesn't look good also. So probably Queen F3 is my I'm again too slow. Oh today I'm playing so slow. Take take. And then at the end I try to do something, yeah, when it's super hard. Mm hmm Yeah. Um that's close to impossible to win, I guess. But I'll try. Mm, I'll go to this side, trying to trade. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. This is some triangulation check, so what? Seems like triangle. Um, and he goes this. I mean, he'll play queen f6, definitely, yes. King h3, try to hide here. Queen d4, my good here, that's a question. F6, b4, can you. Okay, F6. What is that? Mm hmm. B4, this. Yes, that's. Who has bigger SpongeBob? I mean, who has bigger pants? I'm gonna take this one. A6, A3. I'm faster. Oy oy oy. Oy oy oy. Wow. It's actually a pretty tough one. And I want to make it a little bit of 2005. Wow. Perfectly. So, Magnus probably gonna win this. Yeah, I guess so. So, um. Yeah, that was a crazy game, I'd say. Play in Trahim of 1973. Oh, uh, G3. Bishop G2. Castle and other Catalan. Never mind. Boom. Ah, okay, another. Another more or less drawish position. I mean, equal. Definitely. I mean, okay, Bishop F4, Bishop D6, Bishop G5. No, he doesn't play. Uh, any of those moves? <laughs> oh, surprising it's not. But he doesn't play anything at all. No, he plays something. 
<clears throat> but nothing of this moves, I said. Yeah. That's more precise, insane, I guess. <laughs> let's go! Even though I give d5 square, just let's go. <laughs> let's go! Be quiet, please! Please be quiet, everyone. Let me trap my opponent. La la la. Wait, didn't he trap? Uh -huh. Whoa, he somehow survives long. But Rook, exchange, doesn't survive. Tun tun tun. Ba -ba -bum, ba -ba -ba -bum. I first saw, first, <laughs> since I thought when he played this. Rook I said, what? I mean, your queen is saying it, what are you doing? <laughs> okay, I'll go for this. And I'm greedy. I am very pretty greedy. Boom. Hey, what can I do? <laughs> Let's just zoom zwang his queen. Let's just trap not zoom zwang. Just trap his queen. Why not? Oh, th that's ideal. That's perfect. That's perfect. That's perfect. Uh, um, I'll go for this and queen of three. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Boom. Wait, I mean, I don't really, maybe I don't want to, let's maybe should be C, say I because I don't really want to trade, I don't see any good future. Let's maybe do this. If he doesn't go for H5, but he goes trade, but still I'll go and trade. Uh, maybe, he, yeah, he won't, but you just want to do this. And I want the Rahim of 1973. Good game! Nice one, I guess, from me. Just trapped, look. Look at, you, at his pieces. Yeah, they weren't so good. And I won the game, Rahim of 1073. Magnus wins. Uh, Tamer wins. Okay. Since it's spicy and sneaky to lebed if here, I lost the advantage at g4. Really? I saw g4 is 6 in Petra, but okay. Mm. And against Rahim of was pretty much good one, I guess. Yeah, and against the Master Benefactor. I mean, I was cool. At some point, maybe I was winning at the beginning, I don't know though. Yeah, I was better, and I was completely, I hear I was losing, then he blundered, there was a draw, but I didn't have time, and then rook g6, I had to play like rooks. Yeah, I mean, rook g6 was a bad blunder, then I was close, I pray moved king of 3, I, I 10 times tried to play king of 3, but didn't work. In Rahim of it was also a nice one, so I got him like at the beginning, and... And yeah, until the end, I hold it him. It's in his on his side. And then it's Nikit Kazero five twenty five. Bada 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 Wait, what? What is this? I guess it's c five. Maybe that's just a weird pawn sacrifice. It is right. Yes, it is. Yay! I sacrificed the pawn for no reason. Wahoo! Yay! Let's go. No. Um, I would actually like my pawn back. <laughs> I, you loaned it, uh, I gave it on, on loan, but now I would like to have it back. And I'll be, okay, okay, I got the pawn, but he's trappy, so he wants more than the pawn, something more than a pawn. Oy, oy, oy. Let's do this. Uh, queen seven. La la la. I mean, okay, slightly worse position, I guess, uh, probably I'll put a4, so we can do, be quiet, something like this, maybe that's a bit too, not unrealistic, but I'll try, 
<laughs> so funny. Well, um, yeah, it won't happen at all. But let's try. Why not? This win here. This, this, this is made. Boom. <laughs> What's wrong? Isn't it beautiful? It's not, I guess. AG. Oi. It's actually not beautiful at all. Oops. Oh, and on an exchange now. Yikes. <laughs> um, and for no compensation. This I'll take with Rook, <laughs> brother of uh, twin of my Rook, which which will get captured soon. Wants to get a revenge. <laughs> um, win H four. A Rook. Okay, twenty-four. Yikes. Mm. Let's defense a bit. Let's defense. Defense is the best attack. Nope. Um, let's just do this. Alright, wait, it was the other way around. Best defense is attack, not the best attack is defense. <laughs> Lol. Yeah. Okay, this. <laughs> Remembered how it is, but <laughs> I misplaced something. Oh, that's actually spicy. Let's go! Best defense is... No, best attack is defense! Let's go! <laughs> best attack is defense, lol. Um, pew, 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 la la la. Best attack is defense. <laughs> Sounds weird. Uh, check. This, 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 booms, should be good. If I don't blunder anything <laughs> after first move of variation, um, <laughs> definitely not, definitely. Definitely, right? I don't blunder anything? I guess so. Nice attack! Sacrifice and exchange, uh, I blundered, yeah, okay, let's say I sacrificed it. Ah, uh, but then twin of my rook, which got eaten. With Queen and with Knight, made it the opponent. Nice! One hour, 11 minutes, 11 seconds were left, but now it's more than that. Okay, Queen, this. Oh, wait, where's the win? <laughs> where is it? It's like half a second away. Oopsie doopsie, where is this? I mean, I can go Knight, okay, Knight F2. Okay, that's it. Check. And boom, and Queen D1. Nice. Um, take probably. Uh, yes, okay, main. Main is not to blunder mate in one. <laughs> um, okay, this. Oh, is this first game for today where I'm not down on time? Yay! Okay, check. 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 I know Andre Mnikit has either 525. Why did you want me to make brilliant mate? Why you give up one move before the mate? No. Okay, I played him five days ago. Yeah, in the bullet. He made one mouse sleep and then he maybe went to play D Dixie. I don't know. He was plus what? What? Yeah, I mean, okay, here he was definitely, but then e4, g and g4 wasn't good. Then against I still be g. Oh, okay. La la. Boom, night e3, night e3, boom, night e3, night e3, boom, night e3, boom, night e3, why don't you want to blow? Night e3, no, why? No, why? What? Hey, <laughs> what was that? No, why? Okay. No, why? Um, b5, attack! Let's go! A b6, let's smash him! Let's not let him do anything. Let's just trap him. Woohoo! E4 and table on H5. Yeah, probably 
this move e4 is not always nice. I guess knight a4 immediately would have been a finish already because knight a4 b3 and then I can go e4 and smash him over there. Um, I mean, I would say it's not a disaster, but my pawn hangs. <laughs> and as you know, pawn grabbers enjoy the pawns, and he's very unhappy when pawns are eaten. My opponent, when he's pawn, he's happy. Um, when he's pawns are eaten, then. Uh, oof, yeah, yeah, I created very not. Okay, I'm gonna go for knight a4. Yeah, I, <laughs> I played very not good. Um, oh, and tear is hanging. Yikes. Okay, I'm a pawn down. And I could have been like completely winning from the opening, I guess. Um, never mind. Or should I mind? I guess. I hope. I guess no. Okay. Am I only one pawn down or even more? Yeah, I mean, okay, e4. Just play knight a4. And it's like didn't get. He didn't went from opening even. Um, I have knight e5. No, I don't. Yeah, I have to take. This, this, I will still will try, uh, but okay, <laughs> no, that I could have done much better than that, um, maybe not much, but better than that, definitely, hmm, Okay, I'll take. I'll do this. Ninety-five. I'll try. Still try because not everything, not everything is lost yet. Um. Yeah. <laughs> um. Ah. Ouch! I would enjoy it not to tr to not trade, but yes, it's not really possible to have a knight position. Or may mate wait wait what? Uh, wait, I have this. So if to trade and let's say like my rook is a bit more active than it was. Now oh, this. Wait, he can castle yet, right? He can still castle. Hey, I forgot about this lol. <laughs> That's funny. That's very funny. I thought he's already like, like me, but okay, he's not. Yeah. Okay. Uh, take now. Cast. No, oh, KF one. Okay. <laughs> he he forgot that he could have castle. Okay. <laughs> okay. Okay. Be quiet. Be quiet. I have a trap. Hmm. Okay. Check. Check. Check you. Check you. Well, take you. Take you. <laughs> no check you. <laughs> okay. Mm. Yeah, I'll play with little comments now. So let's go H5. H4. Mm-hmm. Let's draw to hold.
and also gave my slow RPG. I was so slow. Come on, trippy guy. Yeah. Um, and also <laughs> should be a game what should end up in a draw, but I'm too slow. Okay. I played quite good, I guess. Mm. Yeah, okay. Yes, I didn't have a win at all anywhere. Maybe at the beginning when I till I played this brilliant E4, maybe here plus two. Mm, plus one, plus two, how much? Legends in 2010. Hey, why are you so slow? Plus two around. <laughs> yeah, but but then but then it was drawish. Like for most of the game. Oh, wait, why didn't I go here? I mean, Bishop before is here. Whoopsie doopsie. La, la, la. Uh huh. Mm hmm. This will take me takes. No, he does not. Take, he doesn't take. Wait, Queen B7, this is a trap. Uh, <laughs> excuse me, is this a trap? It seems like it, so no, I won't do this for now. Mm -hmm. I didn't say Slots was a nice one. Yeah, it's slightly better than here, slightly better than here. Yeah, he had castle. <laughs> It's, that was quite funny when he forgot that he had castle. <laughs> Even I remembered. I mean, I didn't remember, I just understood that King Rook didn't move, so it's possible to do it. <laughs> but he forgot, so that's quite funny. Eh? When I'm opponent and I, I should not care about his idea, I mean, I should care about his ideas, but I should not care did he play castle? Or, I mean, I should care, yeah, in my variations, but <laughs> even I remembered, but he forgot this. Okay, that was quite funny. Um, yeah. Ba -da -boom, ba -da -boom, take, take. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's take this. La 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 Okay, V for the Nooks 83. This is um, A4. Take, take, take this, take, 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 take this, 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 this is gonna make it one. F3 I'll play at some point, so this is this, take, take, take. We should be one, this is gonna make it F1, King 7, King 1, King, yeah, I guess. It's gonna be alright. I mean, maybe he won't trade, but. <laughs> yes, yeah, still, it's a draw. Yeah, it's three of these. That should be it. Um, okay, he doesn't want to trade, but never mind. Um, I can place these G3. Okay, G3, H4. No one can break through at all. <coughs> Uh, bishop here. Yeah, it's draw. It's a draw. I mean, I can offer trade. I guess it won't be a disaster. If he need cancel. If he doesn't cancel, then maybe then I can play and win, like play a4. This stuff. <laughs> but okay, I guess he'll just play, ignore and play a4. If he plays a4, then he's the draw. There. Okay, but he takes an NA4, right? Or are you playing a uh, calculation B4? He is! <laughs> A4, he's three, he's should be okay there. Skin D2, this, this. Oh, he, he, he. Take, take this. King D3. Now that should be a draw. Don't scare me, please. Okay, I should take. Now King D3, King D2, and I guess I should hold. Okay, king d3, king d2, king d3, yeah, you can break through king d2 and draw this, 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 this. Um, and I draw the game. Dolphin 2010. Now let's have a look at the game of. Um, 
have Grandmaster, Grandmaster, uh, Queen and a Sudden Revenge against Leopard Trap. Now I'll be back in a few minutes. Hello again. I'm here. Okay. Um. Boom. 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 Second. Okay. Ready. Oopsie. Oopsie. Okay. Now I'm ready. Um. Okay. Magnus is playing very fast draw today. Here he got like completely drawish. Here it's completely draw. Okay. Where is my opponent? I want an opponent. I want an opponent. I want an opponent. Give me an opponent. I play against Less Wireless Castro. Please excuse me if I didn't correctly write your nickname. Ah, uh, no, no, Benoni. Nope. <laughs> okay, okay, it's Ragozin. La river. This guy has 40 points from Georgia. Oh, wait, no, no, I, I could have played for H6, G5. No, 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 no. But not now. I left, of course. <laughs> um, smash. This is this, 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 this. I guess I should do this first. I know that. Yes, we should be seven in between her. So, no. <laughs> yeah, I was saying an IT4, but okay. He didn't want. He didn't want. He didn't want it. Um. Uh, an IT5. Let's be a trappy ninja. Let's trap him. Yay. Be quiet! Be castle, 84, take, take. I'm up an exchange, or? Ah, yes, rook fd1. Oops. Oops, oops, Take. Rook fd1. Yes, he's fighting. <laughs> Trippy guy. I mean, I made the trap 
but he just protected, so I don't think he's a trippy guy. But I'm trippy, I'm trippy, I still want to get something. Boo boom boom boo boo La 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 ba da bum Can I take it and play night C4? I guess so yeah I guess I can play some do this yeah I can do this yeah mm. Boom Yeah my pawn up at least trippy guy Traps is open it again <laughs> Um Yeah, sometimes to be a trappy guy, you also have to find some quiet moves that, like, just immediately <laughs> attack. Um, no, not attack. Um, make a trap. You sometimes, at some point, uh, if you want to be a trappy guy, that's uh, some tips how to be a trappy guy. Probably none of you <laughs> wants to be a trappy guy, but okay. Um, you also at some point have to be quiet, not like immediate attacks. <laughs> well, yeah, it's like. Not immediate, like it's very clear weather outside, and then like 10 seconds, and then it's already storming. Yeah, um, you have to be at some point, you have to be sneaky so you don't immediately attack on some threat or so. Uh, you have to be just quiet, you have to make move, which just like seem, seems like it's a normal move, like not this direct threat. Yes, I did now, uh, but some quiet moves. Which at the same time you don't play fully trappy, so not like you you only do trappy moves, and then like after twenty of these trappy moves, you understand. Wait, I tried to trap my opponent. He didn't value to these traps, and then I just get <laughs> terrible position. How can you play? How can I play this position after? Um, yeah, just be don't don't try to make traps, which you think is not gonna make your position slightly better so every time you try to make a trap at least for me i do it like this uh don't only make a trap sometimes you only make a trap but let's keep this part um sometimes most of the times it's better to do not direct traps i already repeat but wait and make some sort of a move with what you and improve the position and you at some point can create a threat so direct threats yeah, maybe that was too long talking because I began out on time. <laughs> but okay, okay, okay. We're ready to be fast, happy guy. Yay! Ready three. La 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 la. I don't have any ideas. I just don't have any ideas. Okay. He's not falling, falling into that. Boom. What about this? I'm gonna play with little comments. In my comment in time <laughs> saying how to do traps. Um, I'm too passive. Not just completely. I have to do this. Mm, I have that. I, can, I guess I should play in F7 so that this does not pin my knight. And I have my D3 and my D3 and my A4 ideas also. So, four threats. Mm. Oh, take an 84 and rook D4. Ooh. Okay, <laughs> let's. Comment less, <laughs> bit less than I did. Let's, yeah, you see, I thought it's just a pawn wander, but there was a trap. That's what I mean with moves with. Ah, that's also, yeah, seems like I just double up, but that's a big threat. <laughs> and I won the game, ye less or why less, Castro, good game. So Tamor is actually losing, no, it's slightly worse. Yeah, good game. That was a battle of trappy guys. I mean, at the beginning I somewhat trapped him, but not at the same time. Then it was okay. Then, then, then what? Then, he, yeah, here, you see? I was completely winning. E4 seems like a blunder, and it was a blunder. Uh, but yeah, I just blundered this. I thought that he just blunders, and Rook D4 is a threat, but it was not. So, that's what I meant with undirect threats. Play against Ask Chess or ASK Chess. Good luck. Mm. 
Whoa, it's a bit not to what I wanted to go. See, mm, yeah, okay, okay. First, me time me playing Keen's Indian in my life, I guess. Maybe last time, I'm not sure. I mean, okay, it's not sharp line, yeah, he'll take the take C, because why then you play B3? Usually when you do a fan kata, you don't plan to play aggressive, but still, yeah. Uh, okay, so it was not re a real Kinsindian. Real Kinsindian when it's like, <laughs> yeah, it's tough to explain, and so you don't want to spend a lot of time. It's, it's just crazy. So, <laughs> yeah, it's crazy, see. <laughs> Best word for the, to describe the Indian defense, especially for black. For white, you like more or less understand what to play. But in my opinion, Kinsinian for black is is too crazy because, yeah. Oh wait, it's sneaky exchange sack. But okay, well, I do, I don't want to do get an exchange because it's too trippy there. I don't want to trade queens because I'm pawned down. But I would like to do the small in betweener. So that seems yeah. I mean, I created a trap, small, like bishop e1, bishop e4, etc. At the same time, I and set it some, some traps, and uh, yes, I improved my position because I developed my bishop, etc. Okay, here I'm not scared to take, I'm not scared, and I'm, I'll do this. So, in my opinion, I'm probably worse a bit. I didn't say ninety percent, but still. So you see, at the same time, I create direct threats at e two, and if you look to position a bit more deeper, you start to see that knight e two is also threat, and that's quite sneaky. Is that it's even better than on e two. So yeah, if you want to be trap, if you want to place traps, you have to know these basics. I mean, in my opinion, that's quite nice. Mm, to know this and to use this because yeah if you just played something direct threats it traps it won't may I mean maybe at some point it can work especially if it's like no time left for for opponent but if this is better to do some quiet traps so from this big talk there's another topic which is very important this quiet traps and also quiet moves is also very very important so quiet moves you like protect something you make your position slightly better and then you attack or no attack but you just like have a big attack by yourself and then he attacked something and you have to make quiet move with which with what you like and make your attack a bit better and the and you protect and you defend from his traps. So something like that. So in in my opinion, if you want to be better in chess, you first don't have to place any direct threats. Um, I mean, okay, you can place if you don't make your position worse, just to make. But if you want to place a trap and for this to like make your position much worse than it was. It's just not needed, so these traps are, yeah. You, I mean, it's the same, I guess by this, you can say that you trapped yourself, yeah, because you were too aggressive trying to place trap for him, <laughs> but then you didn't care about your position, and you, uh, <clears throat> after you see that things that you trap, but you didn't trap him, <laughs> it seems that you're already losing, so, yeah. And so, from, in my opinion, if you want to be better in chess, I already said that, but still gonna repeat. You also have to study quite a lot the quiet moves. Quiet moves is very important in chess because it will at some point learn you how to do traps a bit better. <laughs> um, and yeah, at some point, quiet moves is very important. So quiet moves is. One of maybe the most important topic in chess, of course, middle game, end game, and openings are also very important. But quiet moves is one of the most most important. I guess after opening middle game and end game, I'm gonna put quiet moves like 
in important scenes, so it's fourth in, in my list. You can disagree, but it's just, as I said, my opinion, so it's quite important. Okay, this. Um, boom. Yeah, I probably won't win this game by position, but open and spend a bit too many time, and I'll win on time. In I guess position is drawish. And Andre Mask Chess or ASK Chess. How is it in Opera? MVL is Putin pressure. Magnus Wesley started, so Wesley has to win. Magnus has to hold the win. Uh, I, I mean, okay, win is better, but hold is enough also. So, yeah. Yeah, so quiet moves, I guess, is more important than this double attack, sector, this stuff. And play against Lord BG. So, this uh, um, pain, sector, double attacks are, in my opinion, sideways things. And. Middle game opening and white moves is the most important chess. Still, as I said <laughs> thousands of times, it's only my opinion. You can disagree, you can agree with that. Yeah. Yeah, but if you're a beginner, probably it is it is better to start with some basics. Yeah, like double attack. Then pin, discover attack, then deflection, then what skewer, I guess, also is quite important. So it's only if you want to be a bit better, then quiet moves will, I guess, put you to this goal. Um, yeah. Okay. So I have to be, I, I guess I should come back to my game because I didn't play to open and very cool. Yes, and I guess I'm already slightly worse, at least slightly, maybe much worse. Um, okay. Yeah, I don't remember any quiet moves, uh, puzzles, but maybe if I find some maybe at some point I can show um, maybe <laughs> in next game I'll play maybe I can get them so it will be quite nice also to show and to see if I found um, but okay I'll I'll show you you don't have to browse every single game and to <laughs> see to scroll it and, and understand because you have to also understand what is quiet moves so yes I'm gonna show you one cool scene after this game, of course. Um, okay. I will come back and then maybe this is idea. So, what is this? I forgot. Not discount attack, not deflection. Interference, I guess. Yeah, I guess interference is the correct word. Um, Tell me if I'm a bit wrong. Let's go a6 and now because I didn't want to play this now because c takes d this and a b5. It's interesting. Does he understand what is my idea or no? Maybe that's bad, but I would like to try it. This interference. Maybe I'm just like it'll be worse after it, but I guess if I want to have fun, it's worth a try. But and I want fun, so it's really worth a try. Okay, so yep, um, more or less understood that that will happen. Um, I actually was not ready that he'll go for this. I'm not ready to sacrifice a pawn, so I'll try as much as it possible to create some counterplay. So I'll give a check. I'll come back. So here, this and this is threat. So if you place queen b6 and that, now I don't have any threat. <laughs> but okay. Um, dun, dun, dun. Let's give a check and then f5. Oh wait, I blundered queen e5. Yes, my pawn is weak. You also have to check about weak pieces. So. Mm -hmm. 
I guess queen f2 looks quite cool, and he takes f, I can try to play e4. So try to break through, because rook f5 is probably playable, and maybe that's even better than that. But now I'm in the mood of position where I have to break, I mean the mood, I mean, I would like to have the position where I want to break through, and it's quite sharp, because rook f5, even though it's quite sharp, it's not that sharp. Maybe I actually blunder something, as it seems. Um, yeah, it seems like I did blunder a bit, like 22 pawns. Mm. We have to play a bit faster also. Win c3, I'll take. Yeah, probably rook f5 was a bit more, not comfortable, but how describe. Mm, a bit more safer than that. Okay, still doesn't look bad. I, I have something like this as, as, as idea. I'll play with little comments. Oh, I cannot go to f4, I was close. <laughs> that was very close though. Um. Oi! Oi, I blundered that. Oi, oi, oi. Oh, he had to. Oh, yo, yo, I could have taken a rook. He lost again by Slumber G. He hanged a rook. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, I yeah, could have get it. Um. So what do I want? Let's, ah, okay. Play against Danzino21. Yeah, younger rook. Come on, trappy guy. Come on. <laughs> okay, here you see I didn't see a weak pieces, but here it was quite tough because when you don't wait some sort of this gift, especially in like big time trouble, <laughs> it's quite tough to realize that it's a gift and yeah. So here I also didn't realize in time that there was a free rook. I realized like 10 seconds after <laughs> when I already was a losing position. So yeah. <laughs> yes, it would have been better if I realized in the game. And I got it. Probably I would not win on time because I was slow on time, but still. Oh, Queen E2. This is a blunder? I guess so. Seems just like a fast win. Or at least a winning position already. Yeah, that's quite fast win. Nice. Queen e7, and then I'll go for a g5 and checkmate is stoppable with this, but I can just take smash through. Again, task chess, it was quite nice what I wanted to show. Um yeah, okay. <laughs> Didn't spend many time on this game. So Magnus is slightly a bit worse. Uh, so what do I want to show? Puzzle themes, if you go. Um, there's how you see what puzzles. And about quiet movie, I was saying quite a lot. Probably the scene you can go is... Wait, where where is it? You see advanced. Okay, he takes this. Yeah. Um, yeah, so I'm winning. It's just like May 28, Bishop B5, that's why I go. So, and you see in advance there's quiet move, and then you can choose hard quiet move. So here it's like, what, like, I guess Rook D5, and, or Rook F5. So you have to think about quiet moves. And on Dream Danzino 21, then you can cho choose if you want easy ones, and go to easiest, and then you'll see some quiet moves. So F like F five for example and Bishop H six. So yeah, that's quite cool scene. So if you want to make some topic better, it's quite nice to do here. And you all don't you don't have to choose quiet moves. There's much much more themes than this quiet move. So yes, it's just quite cool. And you can choose toughness of puzzles. You can choose very hard, you can choose okay, hard ones, you can choose normal ones, you can choose very easy ones, so... And then you can see the Schmatz Clement, because they're the Master, and Tanzino, I played 1-0-0, that was a nice one. Yeah, but okay. 
he didn't get good from opening e6. Take this. I will start with this. That's actually maybe not super cool because yeah. Wait, I don't want neither. But if I do this and no, oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, yes, I should go for this. Maybe we can trans. No, we don't transfer to <coughs> any lines I know. So let's let's play something new, guys. <laughs> oh wait, maybe I know this more or less. I guess so, right? <laughs> I forgot everything, but um, I don't know. Rook f8, bishop g5. That's not good. I don't. I'm not a fan of these types of positions. Hey. What is this? It's a position which I don't like. Ui, ui. Boom, if I do this, 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 queen e7, it looks bad. This, this, this. Ooh. Okay, let's try bishop e5. Uh, but still before yeah, that doesn't look like good position at all from opening you see <laughs> um, You can also sometimes get trapped from opening uh, so you have to be careful Okay, still hope I kept something like this if take take I guess I should I oh, know I will be down in exchange so take, take, bishop f8, king f8, knight b3, and then bishop f7, b take c, bishop e5. That's quite a tough line to calculate. He has two weak uh, double pawns, uh, but he also has an exchange. So I guess my plan of play is somehow try to <clears throat> get these double pawns. His plan is just to realize the advantage and not let me to make much of counterplay. Uh, he still sinks, and he plays knight b3. So, yeah. Um, boom, boom, boom. I guess I'm actually gonna play bishop c7. We take c, knight c6. It's my, oh wait, after knight c6 you can just play f4. That's a bit of a problem. Um, yeah, oh no, he takes, but then f4, right? But then I'll play d6 or f6. Yes, d6 is slightly better. And I'll try to get something from this position. Um, let's say I'm gonna do this rook c8, um, but he has she can just cancel it. Yeah, didn't get didn't get nice from the opening, so I'm trying still. But after rook d1, knight f5, I guess I'll be g4. I'll be a full rook down. Still don't give up. Mm, but. It would have been a bit easier to play with at least an exchange down than a full full rook. Um, okay, I'm still gonna do this and play bishop b5, I guess, and rook c3, something like that, or bishop e no, not bishop a4. But still, I'm, I'm gonna not give up because <laughs> what's the goal to give up? I mean, if you give up, you lose, and if you get mated, you also lose. But if you get mated, you at least try to do something. Um, but if you just give up, you get. Could have probably had something, but just don't use it. Mm. So yeah. Um, <clears throat> let's play rook c2. Yeah, and if you're down material, it's better to try to get back, back this material. And also, if it's possible, um, try to avoid trades. So try to avoid some exchanges of pieces, change of pieces, etc. If possible, if not possible, as here I had, then yeah, just deal with it. Because <laughs> you cannot change it, you try it, and yeah. It's not possible, there's no problems. But if possible, try all your best. Um, rook e2. Rook f2. <laughs> Uh, okay, I'm still now he's quite low on time, so probably that's my only chance in the position in this game. Not in the position, in the position, I have no chances, but in time, from time point of view, I can try to flag him. So I mean, two times more on time. <clears throat> okay, I got a pawn. 
the end game. Oh, okay, you see? You see? Also, never give up and when it's same trouble, opponents at some point start to give up. Uh, not give up, no. <laughs> I mean, if, if it could have been very cool, yeah? Opponent is 15 seconds, he thinks, ah, no, I'm too low on time, I'll give up, yeah? <laughs> yeah, not give up, but they at some point can start hanging pieces, etc. So, that's why it's also cool to not give up. So, opponents can be quite slow. <clears throat> They're quite slow, it's usually they start to blunder. Yeah, okay, you see, I'm not I'm not better on the position at war. Maybe it's slightly worse. No wonder Mr. Muscle even goes to the Inter Master. But he, <laughs> he played quite slow in an angry bishop. Yeah, he thought that he wins my bishop, but because my bishop was pinned, but my rook helped. So, also, coordination of pieces is also quite important. So, if it's possible, also try to make it great. Yeah, of course, if possible. Um, but it was a nice game. <laughs> and against Clan P. I mean, game not... I mean, I played <laughs> very bad this game. Uh, but I mean, nice that she blundered and she was quite slow. I actually, at the end, also was quite slow. But I had, like, already equal position and had more time. So I had easier, easier plays than he had because... I didn't have any time pressures that, oh, I'm low on time, be careful. Yeah, because why he blundered? When you're low on time, it usually works like this. You're low on time, you see that you're low, lower than you're open, and, and you understand, wait, if I spend a bit more time, I'll, I'll lose some time. And then when you <laughs> try to play fast or open, it doesn't matter. Um, <laughs> then most some of the times there's just like a blunder because you are in the pressure or the open intent. He thinks, wait, 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 <laughs> and then yeah, he blunders something. Okay, let's come back to play. I guess I blundered a pawn from opening. I'll play ninety five still, so I won't. I'll try to not play H G takes H because in my opinion, after G takes H, um, he's completely winning. But here I'm also not better, I guess. <laughs> So, I'll have to try all my best, again, like in the game against English Master Klimenko, Sergei International Master. Um, let's play bishop f5. Please. Take, take. Um, here, I have some counterplay, even though I'm down a material, I have some counterplay. So, not like in previous game, <laughs> rook for nothing. Yeah, here I have two bishops. Two bishops are usually stronger than two knights. <clears throat> and it's called two bishops advantage. And, yeah, at some point I try to create problems for him. Because in chess, especially when you're down a material. And even if material is even and you try to win, you, of course, have to try to create problems for your opponent. Because if you don't, then he also just chill and then, and then like nothing, yeah? But here I have two bishops, and two bishops, why is there stronger than knight and bishop, or bishop? Oh, wait, okay, you see? He just blundered also. You see, he just blundered a knight. So, two bishops are putting also at some point pressure. Because two bishops are strong, as they just... Why? The reason is, they just like, if they put in the middle, they just like, nearly... Um, not forgetting, wait, controlling nearly whole board, so... So yeah, <clears throat> bishop f5, mm. let's go for this, <clears throat> yeah, so two bishops is a big power, and if you have two bishops, then, I mean, okay, you're not always winning, <laughs> you still have to try to show your best, but most of the time, if you check positional point of view, usually you're better.
And here we go, you see? Two bishops, one bishop is controlling you controlling h3 square, so king cannot run away, and other is controlling these two squares, and rook mate, and I want to clan p. Okay, again, I didn't play it from opening, super cool. Uh, but okay, then he blundered a knight, and I successfully realized this bishop advantage. So, yeah, quite nice. And my next opponent is Gansk. Good luck. Yeah, I guess I was not losing, but I was not winning also, so that was just like something like, let's say, slightly better for him. I was minus 2.1. Minus 2.1, he's not losing. But after bishop h6, I was just like slightly here. But <laughs> actually, when I had two bishops versus a knight and a bishop, I already was plus 0 0.5. It's just like <clears throat> it's so close to equal because. Um, so no one really had an advantage, I just had a bit, little, 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 little bit of an advantage. Um, yeah, he, when he did this, he was already losing. Okay, let's come back to play. Um, this, I guess he can get maybe a, even an extra pawn. Not sure about an extra one, but I'll get all my pawns back. So as I said, yeah, two bishops in previous game were quite powerful, <laughs> and actually his knight was not good because knight cannot jump through all boards at one move, but bishops at some point, if they are placed nice, they can. I won't rush with taking a pawn, I guess to win a queen with knight a 6 is a bit better, of course, of course, he not blundering the queen that easily, but... Um, if he plays queen e8, then I play queen b4, queen c4, so... Ah, okay, he plays this. But what if I play this? Ah, queen d6. That's move I actually somewhat missed. That's true, cool cool point. I thought queen e8 or queen d7, 9, 8, 7, 8, 6. Um, but here he's somewhat cool, I guess. Um, I mean, I don't have to take... Um... <laughs> Maybe I can play, I don't know, knight d2. Yeah, let's say knight d2. If take, take, then I take. Yeah, take. Queen b4, then I take. Castle, rook c1. Try to get another pawn. Only I don't get it for b equal on pawns. I already want to get it to be up a pawn. So, <clears throat> so knight c4 is not a threat. Oops. Um, but still, I quite like my position because... In my opinion, he's playing a, bit, a little bit passively, so, um, yeah, I'm saying this. Uh, take, take, so if rook d8, I can play n8 to 6, with the idea of protecting pawn and attacking the rook, n8 to 7, or n8 to 5, n8 to 3. Also, you can play e3, so I protect the pawn. Um, yeah, in these types of position, um, I can play knight c6 and this stuff. Also, seeing I can play... Instead of castle, yeah. Usually castle is nice, but in this end game type of positions, it's sometimes cool to play e3 king e2 because in end game you have to have your king as much as possible closer to middle because in end game uh, no queens usually if it's not queen end game no queens are usually on the board and um, in most of the time. King in the middle of the board is much better than king in the side of the board because king in the middle of the board controls much, much more. You can run to every single side. But, yeah, so if you can, better to leave your king in the middle. But if he has some direct threats, which you don't really like, it's better <coughs> to castle. Especially if he has, like, here, he has king on g8 also. So, I don't really lose anything on tempos, because it will take us around more or less the same amount of time to come back. So, on tempos it will be quite quite a tie. Um, mm -hmm. Okay, rook c1. If takes, take. If take, okay, he doesn't take. Uh, I can play e3. Maybe that's the move I want, so now this one does not hang because of this bishop uh, skewering or something like that. 
And now idea is to take knight to e5 and something like this and then just chill. Move, I guess, he'll place knight b4 because it creates some problems. So knight d3 is a threat with threat of this. I'll probably play answer with bishop f1 and then bishop c4 will take with rook and rook c7 or rook b4 and I guess I should be better. Yes, I got it. Bishop f1, I'll take with rook. Okay, he doesn't take. So probably I'll do this. Then I'll take with king, as I said, yeah, my, uh, in the end game, what king is closer to the middle is better. So now I have king here, so I can run that here to middle and to here. Um, what do we have right now? Rook f7, some tricks with knight d3. Does it really give, give, give them something? Probably something, but not many things, so I guess I'll take knight d3. Rook f6 seems nice, so I do. And as I attack, and now, you see, um, if I had king on g1, I had to go only to g2, and then knight e1, some crazy checks, yeah, maybe not crazy. But now I can just run to here, and, okay, and you see, he just trades, and I am completely winning. So, king in the middle of the board is better than king not in the middle of the board. And other name, Gkansk. So you see against Clamp, um, here he was better. He had to play c5 and try to take more space. Space is another very important topic. Uh, but he would like to take a material. And I got the two bishops. And then he here he already minus two. So this, like, I don't know. Oh, play against Alexander, one, two, three. But okay, so something like this you understood, yeah, so bishop and knight is uh, slightly better. Against guns I played one nil nil, cool. Um, d5, Alexander, I don't remember, we played quite a lot of time ago. Um, oh, hello, the 10 again, I'm here. So, yeah, here in this type of position you can play this or g3 and fan cat as a bishop. Probably fan cat as a bishop is not seems not super cool because bishop is pointing to the pawns, but at some point it can be cool. For example, maybe knight d2 was cool, so knight c4 because in this opening it's one of the most important ideas. And now I cannot do it. Um, but okay, Queen C2 still hoping that he won't take, but he will. Yes, he made his idea. I did not really make my idea. Came true in in this opening. So yeah, he he got probably from opening. We both got not worse, but I'd say probably a lead a slight lead for him because he has knights and. That's another important topic, bishop versus knight. Because bishop is can travel like uh, all board through one uh, one in one move, yeah? So bishops are much more better in open position. But knights, as we know, can jump through pieces, etc. And for knights it's better to have a close position because knights can jump and bishops they cannot jump, the, they cannot do so big moves. So, if to say, if like, why say him that he has slightly advantage? Because he has two knights. Knights can jump. But they have two bishops. But in this position, bishops are not stronger. Okay, queen d1. And my knight is not the best. I could have taken. But he also could have taken my queen, and then he has a very strong pawn, and bishop b2 is an idea, so <clears throat> that's not really good. So should I take, give him my only knight? I guess even if he takes, I can take queen d4. Probably he won't take, though. But if he takes, I can play bishop b2. <clears throat> I guess he'll take it on b7, on g7, excuse me. Um, now I guess I'll take, so... What about this position? I guess I'll take, because if queen here, then these, these, I mean, I'm not bad. Um, wait, queen d4 seems quite cool, so I can try to play versus his queen. Um, so, okay, his idea is to take my bishop, and I'll play bishop e2. I had bishop d1, but it's quite passive I close connection through my rooks. Oh, okay, I messed this up, though. I <coughs> completely messed it. Uh, ba -ba -boom. I guess queen d3, 
is a move I should do. Otherwise, I mean, queen d1, queen d1 is possible, but nah. Okay, take, take. And I'd say he's already not slightly better. I'd say he's already better. Not much, but better. Maybe much, because he has two pawns and he still has his knights. And yeah, I mean, even though this position is quite open, he has this. Oh! Uh, wait, I have to think. Let's take, let's see. Let's see what he prepared for that. Okay, so it seems, yeah, he, he saw all of that. It's not a surprise for him. Yes, I'll do this, b3. I'll take, I'll play rook a2. I'll try, <clears throat> now knight c3. Okay, I'll play with a bit less of comments because position is not better for me and not winning, of course. So it's not ideal position. I have to try to at least to do this. Um, yeah, so I'll try. And yeah, I'm a bit also lower on time. It's also not cool. <clears throat> Uh, ah, and yes, it's a cool move. But okay, yes, then I should go for that. Takes. Um, king of two, king to here. Yeah, he'll he'll do it. He'll do it. I guess. Um, okay, let's do this. Some traps. Her. <laughs> yeah, here is direct trap. He protected so from direct traps. It's much easier to protect them from some quiet traps. Um. Losing now, taking two pawns down. Um, these okay, now even three. These, these, that check. These, mm. Oops, yeah. Run, kid, run! Go! Still mate, okay. No. <laughs> and the last game, Alexander 1 to 3. Yeah. Um, I didn't get nice from opening. Here there was a big fault that I played very passive in opening it. Nin 3 day at anything. Okay, Magnus lost, so, okay. And. MVL won, so probably all matches will end up in a draw today. So, yeah. Um, I'm playing Skansk again, only this game I am black. Wait, I'm playing with black piece, yeah. Uh, E6, because G6 was quite weird. Oh, oops, it's quite loud. Um, I mean, I can play these, even though B6 it's maybe slightly better, this is also not bad. And we got land London system, takes this, yeah. So position I'd say is somewhat equal. Maybe here slightly better. Mm. Yeah, because in London usually white slightly better than black because yeah. Okay, I'll take. He has some more space here, that's the problem of these types of position in London for black, because he has more space. At some point it's maybe cool for black to get rid of this annoying pawn that blocks my queen, my bishop, and make may, may block more of my pieces, if he didn't block with the knight. I at some point would maybe consider sacrificing this pawn with d4 move. But now as he blocked, it will be quite tough. But I'll put his queen away and knight d4. Maybe can put his knight away. And yeah, <laughs> it'll be tough. But let's try it. Knight c5 is quite a cool move, in my in my opinion. Um, yep. Okay, if I take this, this... No, that's too passive. I would... 
like to get rid at least of some pieces. Yes, he doesn't want to take. Uh, with knight also, right? Yes. Because if he does so, then I have d4 ideas and maybe I'm even slightly better. Oh, wait, I have to be careful with these ideas. Um, bishop h6 can be trippy. Let's play king h7. b4, knight a4. Uh huh. To be careful, maybe at some point I should play queen e7 and put my knight back. Okay, will he take? That's the question. No, he does not. Um, okay, what can I do? Yes, this knight is a bit of an annoying piece. Try to trap him. I mean, okay, it's direct threat. It's... Oh, wait. Okay, he didn't protect from a direct threat. That was quite easy to protect uh, from, but okay. As it seems, sometimes also direct threats works. Um, yeah, what's, what is important... Um, I did a direct threat, right? So that you you can say, hey, Tian, but you, you said direct threats are not cool. Why did you do it? And, um, I did it because at some point, even though it was a direct threat, I made my bishop position a bit better. So it was on b7 looking in my pawns, but now my bishop is quite, at some point, can be quite dangerous for him. So... Yeah, direct threats are can be cool at some point, but don't do direct threats just to make them. Uh, try to do direct threats combined together with um, making your position better, <laughs> because chess usually is a game of traps, but yeah, if you don't have nice position, any trap won't work. So yeah, let's think, what do I have here? Actually, also, this direct threat, but it's like impossible to protect my pawn. So, I guess I'll play that and bishop a6, bishop d3, I guess. Yeah, bishop d3 and try to put my bishop to this square. So, it will be even more better there. Of course, he can take my bishop, and then his knight is I'm sort of annoying again. Oh, but okay, he ain't seen his knight, and now I'm a rook up, and yes, rook should be enough. You see, it also was a direct threat to bishop and to knight, but he hanged a knight, he hanged a knight. and I wonder him Kansk. Good game, good game. Yes, that was quite nice one in my point of view. So will Rajabov win this one, or it will be a draw? Probably draw, but still, everything can happen. What? First guy, first place, got a free win. Hey, that's lucky guy. <laughs> nice. So, me, I guess if I'll get another open, and that probably will be a last one for today and play against Dolphin 2010. I guess that's the last game for today. Mm-hmm. <coughs> Previous game today against him, I played and it ended up in a draw. Let's see if I can manage to do something against him in this one. Let's see if I can manage to win. <clears throat> okay, so this yes, we should be seven or b five, I guess. B five, this, 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 this. We should c seven. We should be five. That that no. Yes, I'll come back. So that at some point maybe queen b3 was a bit of yeah it was a provoking move not a bit of but at some point maybe it was not good provoke uh, move because yeah I made his knight I guess slightly better because here in this opening it's idea to play b5 knight c4 at some point for him so maybe maybe it's it would have been better if I didn't do so but maybe I'm fine I don't know. <clears throat> These, these, these. I'll play bishop d3. Maybe I don't have to play it, but I don't know. <laughs> now knight d3. No, I guess queen d queen d3. <clears throat> um, no castle. These b5. I guess I should go for b3. I mean, I should not. I don't need to, but probably I will do it. Um. Okay, because knight c4 is an idea, mm. or should I play like, I mean, okay, I don't shoot, but do I need, okay, 
it's more or less the same. Maybe let's say I'm gonna do knight e2. <clears throat> yep. Mm -hmm. So if he takes, then I guess it should be alright because knight c4. I guess I can just play something like b3, and that won't be bad for me, I guess. Um, and if he doesn't take, I don't know. It's also, I guess, should not be bad. You can play maybe b3. Maybe that should be all right, I don't know. Mm -hmm. Is b3 what I should consider? No. Knight c6 probably, of course. No, I guess b3 is the move I'm gonna do. Because knight c4 is idea which doesn't, when I think about it, doesn't make me feel, feel comfortable. So now I'm gonna do this. Maybe, I don't know, he has knight e4, so maybe that's not what I needed to do. Yikes. Um, let's do this f3. Yep. Yep. Um, he offers a trade. I can take. Yes, I will. F3. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, he has Queen C2 ideas. That's why he, he offered a trade. Queen C2 is quite sneaky. Um. Mm -hmm. Mm-hmm. You sell the traits and under key Wait, what did what did I do? Trap guy. Oops. Okay, he'll take of course. This is good for him. Let's play Queen E2. I saw take and Rook E1, but there he is Rook C2. So, not what I really would like to have here. I would do this and I would do that. So, if Rook C3, now Rook E2. So, he does this. Yeah, now Rook C3. Um, E4. Yeah, I guess it's only move. I can not lose any material because Rook E1 was too passive in my opinion. Mm-hmm. Ah, rook d2. Um, okay, he'll play f6, of course. Yes, he does. Um, h3. K8. 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 Rook. I don't know, g8. This, this, uh, g3, b3, k7. Ah, okay, I'll play with a little bit less comments. Game Dolphin 2010. Ooh, King of 3 was a big blunder. Yeah, I definitely had, I guess, something like yeah, King G3 is the same, I guess. Uh huh, yeah. I don't know, I guess I had something maybe like Rook A7. Maybe I'm okay. Yeah, I guess Rook A7, I gotta be okay. Um, okay, so I'll guess 17th place out of 453 players. I type in the chat. Thank you all for the games. Congrats, congrats to Areva, Areva Zelasha, Grandmaster Arnelos, and to Grandmaster Benefactor. Okay. 
So today I got 70 displays out of 38 players, but home's 2,591, game display 21, win rate 62, because I crash cause either and the average of 18 to some 400. Um, okay, here it was, okay, drawish position. Rook a6 was a bond, I had to go for h4. Okay, here I didn't have any chances. Yeah, actually that was quite a sneaky plan with rook b3, rook a3. I, <coughs> I didn't see it at all. Um, yeah, good game. In the game against Gansk, he was slightly better, but I managed to win, so probably, yeah, it will be a drawing table. And we also first, Arava Zelasha, 84 points. Second, Grandmaster Nellis, 83 points. Seventh, Grandmaster ben uh, third, Grandmaster Benefactor, 76 points. Fourth, Grandmaster Elixir, 167 points. Fifth, Jean Valjean, 53 points. Sixth, Carnizeros, 49 points. Seventh, Lord BG, 48 points. Eighth, Fidemaster ALD, 2, 46 points. Ninth, Dolphin, 2010, 44 points. And tenth, Artem US, 43 points. <coughs> okay, I'll show you all players who played in the tournament. Okay. Next. Yes, yeah, so I got 17 out of 454 players. <coughs> Next, next, next. Next, a bit more to go. Boom, 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 boom. Five, four, three, two, one, zero. That's all who played in the tournament. <coughs> so probably. It will be all tomorrow who will be the winner and who will be the third place of the Euro, uh, Opera Euro Rapid. So, first, uh, no, wait, I played today 21 of these games, wins 15 ratings, 13 wins, 3 draws, and 5 loses. Let's analyze all games I drew and all games I lost. <coughs> and then I'll finish stream. Um, <coughs> one, two, three. La la la. Oops. Too opera. Um, <laughs> it was a bit too opera. Um, Ains Krakito della BAP. It was zero next mistakes, something uh, zero blunder seven ever eight any points for me, and zero next mistakes, zero blunder seven ever eight any points for him. We just played perfect game, so we don't, I don't really have to analyze anything because we <coughs> traded like every single rook we could, so it only was two bishops. Then we close the position as much as we can, and here it's a draw the game. Krakito de la BAP. So that was not very important game because we played nil 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 and yeah. In the game against a world champion it was four next three six three blunders twenty nine over eight ten balls for me. And five next three six three blunders thirty five over eight ten balls for him. <coughs> okay, um so what did we had? It's in the next business queen b six and I had to play knight g five. Mm-hmm. Some inaccuracies? I had to play knight g5 also, so knight e6 is an idea, and it's discovered that I can on c6, so I'm quite nice. <coughs> knight e4 in x is on queen a4. Um, <coughs> okay. Then in x is on this. <coughs> mm -hmm. Bishop f1, blunder is bishop 6. I was actually thinking here. But I didn't really like this also, so I decided that it's better to go for bishop f1, but I was losing, then here he blundered a pawn on h6. I didn't take it, but now on h6 the blunder was on bishop d7, because he blundered on h4, and now I have n85 and h6. I of course choose knight 5 so it's a bit better, so I don't trap my own knight at some point. And knight 5 mistake was on c5, I had to play bishop d5 to cut his knight off, then I had to go for bishop f7. <coughs> A5 is on skin B8 and uh, semi necrosis. And here, accidentally, I blundered a fork with three seconds left on the clock. Uh, then I was completely losing. Then he also didn't play it super good. He had to play an AT4, played an C8, and here it's a draw the game, a world champion. <laughs> yeah, so I had like three seconds, he had 13, and I played quite fast and managed to get a draw. At least. <laughs> Wait, I forgot. It was not this. It was wait. Is it? Bishop? Yeah, cut his knight off. Um, now it's bishop f7. I remember it was just come back and then king a5. I guess 
is fine. Wait, MVL maybe go somewhere? Not yeah, okay, it probably should be a draw. Okay, yeah, Kenny okay, Five is correct for him. It oh, Bishop D7, thanks for showing. <laughs> um, H5, Bishop D7. Yeah, okay, Bishop D7. And probably, I guess I would take. I mean, King C5 is not bad also. And, yep. Um, okay, now, what did he add? Some, I guess it was some sort of, no, not cutting the bishop, no? Can be eight, and then, yeah, trade. And now, 94. Boom. In the game, and the last draw game for today, it was, it was against Dolphin 2010. It was for an excellent stake of 118, over 8, 10 points for me. And three next one, stake to Blanche, 19, over 8, 10 points for him. <coughs> Queen B3, I made an next there to go e3 and develop, and bishop b7, blunder percent bishop b4. I had to take, <coughs> I got this in my calculations, but I was a bit too scared. <coughs> that was a bit too scary for me. Okay, I had to take stop fish already. <laughs> Scream said, Queen B7, but okay, I did not do it. <coughs> so he had to go for g5 and to sacrifice an exchange, so he's better. Semi necrosis, rook c3, necrosis on c3. Rook c6 and semi sequence b4, and then we traded, and position was completely drawish. Actually, <coughs> here I offered to trade bi trade a bishop, and I was actually quite scared. I saw that here b4 and he wins, but then I understood that here is a position, and and it is a draw, and here draw the game draw in 2010. So it was take and already scream from Stockfish that I should take. Right. <laughs> For him, okay, we should be four, then it was g5, and then it was, I guess, take is fine. Four. Wait, b4, no, b4, okay. Not him. I thought he played b4. Um, now it's the last five games I lost again. My master benefactor, I, I slow Brigitte Weiss, Alexander 1 to 3, Dolphin 2010. So, Rajabov is playing on win. I see. In the game, is the remaster benefactor. It was quite a lot of blunders. 5 in X to mistake, 5 blunders, 43 over 8, 70 points for him. 5 in X, 6 and blunders. Uh, 5 in five in X, 6 and blunders, 58 over 8, 70 points for me. So, <clears throat> from opening, we got more or less equal. Um, he had to play an IT6, some crazy lines, and uh, at the end, it's a draw. <laughs> <coughs> Crazy. Uh, a g6 blunder had to play bishop d7. If he takes, then I have knight f6, right? Yes. And I'm completely winning. So, and I should develop. f4 mistake he had to take, and I had to play knight c6. Z, sub takes c, and. And I should be better. f5 mistake he had to go for rook d1. Knight f5 blunder he had to go for rook d1 again, so. 95 is blunder versus rook a3. Um, <clears throat> ah, I, I actually didn't see that I had king f8. <clears throat> and here it's probably game would end up in a draw. Bishop b4 blunder had to go for bishop b4. And now it's some sort of Zugzwang. Okay, so c4, rook eight, e1, and yeah. <laughs> Some inaccuracies. Rook a6 is blunder versus rook e7. And here he had rook b3 immediately. Then rook f8 mistake versus g4. <clears throat> King trade blunder versus king h6. And now rook d5 blunder versus h6. He had h6 by his own. So rook f8 is a threat. And here I had to sacrifice a rook. And he would have win quite easily. And now king h2 blunder had to go for rook h7. And still, here he still wins. But okay, then rook h5. I found this resource to get a draw. But I was quite slow and rook g6 is blunder to play for rook c6. Probably I would have lost some time by draw position, but I played rook g6 and <coughs> here I was losing already. Then here queen f8 is in x, and this, queen e4 is in x, and queen e5 and queen e8 is in x, uh, no. And here I lost some time in losing positions again with my benefactor. Here I was like 10 times trying to play king f3 and <laughs> I could not do it, that was quite funny. Already was screaming, why cannot I do it? I just like 10 or more times messed, messed the squares. That was <laughs> quite screamy for. Uh, wait, what was it? Was it to take? <clears throat> no, doesn't seem like it, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Rook 
Rook A7, Rook A8. Ah, Knight G4, we have it made now. Knight was King H6. <coughs> Knight was Rook A1, or no, H6, H6. And now Rook C6. Bishop D, oops. Ah, Bishop D5, yeah, true, 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 true. Uh. <coughs> Um, wait. Hmm. Forgot it. Just like, ah, wait. No, it wasn't that crazy new. Uh, Bishop E2. I mean, I more or less remember. What was it? They don't at the same time. Yikes! Um. Um, so who's better? Okay, draw. Still quite tough to hold for MVL, in my opinion. Um, nope. Oops. Oopsie. Oops. 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 Oops, it oopsie, oops, it oopsie. Do do I don't know, I didn't I tried everything, let's be crazy. Yay, yay, yay. No, that's too crazy. Yay, yay, no, no, no. I don't remember at all. No, 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 no. I just forgot everything. Queen of seven, yay! No, it's not correct. I thought I found it a beautiful move, but no. I mean, what? I mean, I guess I got to save the bishop somehow. Help, <laughs> please help to me. I mean, bishop c1, z, 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 z. So I'm gonna just try everything. Okay, I tried this. Now queen f5, queen h3. I mean, queen e2, queen d1, queen I don't know what else, knight f3, knight f5, knight c2, knight b5, knight b3, no. Bishop, I tried this bishop, I guess I also tried. Rooks, boom, 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 knight king, uh, what? I mean, look at the list, it's already tough to scroll. Oi, oi, oi. What didn't I try? Bishop d3, bishop e2. Oi. Spicy. What? Yes, I tried every single move possible and then I understand that I didn't try to win h7. Yeah. <laughs> um. I mean, I played d5 of that. Knight. Knight e6. Okay, yeah. Was one move that I didn't try. <laughs> Oof. Uh, bishop b4. That was most strongly move I ever struggled to in all time. Okay, boom. And the game against says Lord BG. Four, seven extra mistakes that run 13 over 8 animals. Three six extra mistakes on line 14 over 8 animals. Only. Seven accuracies in opening, did with, which did not matter. Here, um, I got plus 2. And bishop d6 mistake had to go for a6. And say, okay, you take, I take. Oh, wait, yeah. Takes and bishop d2. And I'm slightly better. Castle f6 and I'm better here. But okay. b5 is an accuracy versus knight b6. Ouch. Um, and here to go for bishop b3. Now e4 is London business castle. Some inaccuracies. Now he had to play knight c3, but he took on e4. Now he had to play bishop e7. He had to play knight b3. And bishop f5 is a mistake with some skinny 7 And here I'm slightly better. Then it was equal. Here was slightly better. He was kind of one inaccuracy. He had to castle. I guess he just forgot about the castle. And now we're at 28 seconds, and I was playing so slow, and at some point we already reached position like that. So it was only King Rook, King Rook, but I was super slow, and um, here I lost some time in equal positions in the game. I slowed BG. Good game. <coughs> e A6, I remember. 
Okay, just a castle. Um, and Kini seven. Um, four. Wait, 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 wait. A six castle Kini seven. For him. Ninety six. He. What was it? A cat? Oh, no, but what? Haha. <laughs> okay, ninety three. And now. Maybe uh, three, maybe three. Um, so Avion is losing. Oi, Bishop D5. Will Tim will find it? Spicy. In the game against Lord BG, second game I lost. It was six x one is actually one hundred six seven over eight and for him. Six x one six one hundred eighty nine over eight and for me. Seven x which did which did not matter. I to play D5 instead of Castle and play Pawn down. <laughs> okay. Um, here to play knight first to c3. Some inaccuracies. We've done knight e d5, mistake with some squint c7. And here he had to take his pawn and take his pawn over here. And he's winning completely. Then e4 is an next with on f4. And here I have f5 instead of queen e3. I more or less understood that I have to try something with f5. Queen e3 next with on this. Now queen is 3 blunder to go for queen h4 immediately. And if f takes this, then I guess queen e4, right? And then queen f3 or bishop e4, yeah. Rook e2, this, 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 some inaccuracies. Queen b6 inaccuracy. And rook f5 blunder versus d5. So he's completely winning here. And then he makes a blunder here to go rook d1. He played rook d7. And here I could have taken queen d7 <laughs> instead of queen e5. Probably I would not manage to realize, but still in position. It's nice to end the non -lose. And then here, mate and a lot of game, I slot BG. Okay, remember it's d5. Bishop. Yeah, I remember it's something. <laughs> something on this part of the board. Um, okay, Tamur sinks still. Queen c7. Queen h4, I remember. d5, and just take. Okay, for him, it was c takes d bishop a6, queen b6, uh, no, wait, 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 Can, no, 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 f4. And now rook d1, boom. In the game against Alexander, 1 to 3. I uh, was not good. 18x on the stake, 1 blunder 30 over 8 centibles on me, and 2x on the stake, 0, 1 is 21 over 8 centibles on him. So, just 3 next is on bishop e2, and bishop e4 mistake here to go with knight, and then, I don't know, knight e5. Oh no, okay, bishop g4 is seeming slightly better. Yikes, that's a bit of a fail. Bishop b2, mistake, bishop b1. Let's see next, bishop d one and here I already was completely losing. a5, mistake, bishop b1. He created some unneeded problems for himself, but they weren't huge, and so he managed to win. h5, mistake, bishop d5. Some inaccuracies, h3, mistake, business name b6, and then, and then that was the end. He got third pawn and um, managed to win this quite easily. I tried, but yeah, some inaccuracies, and then at the end he actually made it me, and he made it to LGM Alexander. One, two, three, good game. So, what was my mistakes? Rugby one. My eyes itching, and yeah, h3 made this pawns weak, so wait, I had to play an 87, b 6 yeah. For him, it was, I remember, an g4, and after what I'm even slightly better, <laughs> now it's just simple rook here, and then I guess d5, yeah. And last lost game against Dolphin 2010, so Tamur finds it, so Tamur probably gonna win. So in the game it's not going to so then it was 9x on the second one is 5 or 8 centipals for me and 4x on the second one is 23 or 8 centipals for him. Yeah, here I didn't play that bad that I didn't take on b7 many times. Could take, but I did not. But still he got slightly better. Bishop g5 in x7 on b1. Here I already at minus 2 position. This is this. E4 inaccuracy, and he takes the mistake he just had to take, and it's a double attack, this and that. Bishop of 2 is a mistake, I had to go for rook e1, and try to play down a pawn, try to place this position. Um, okay, some inaccuracies. G5 inaccuracy, G3 inaccuracy also. A5 mistake, this rook b2. 
Um, rook a7, e next, c on h4, he had to play for b4, and I had to play for h4, and try to create my own passed pawn, and probably game would end up in a draw. Um, this, this, inaccuracies, another inaccuracy, and d6, and here he made at me, and I lost game, Dolphin 2010, yeah, so I didn't really play this game very good. And h4 over here. And for him, rook d4, he just showed me the move. <laughs> And wait, what was it? Rook b2. Exactly. Alright, so Tamer wins. So Maxim has to win tomorrow. The match doesn't matter with what score, but it should be more than two without two with more than two points for Maxim. And not more than two for Tamer. So for today, no, I guess Maxim yeah, Maxim should have uh, Maxim should have more than one, more than two, right? And uh, Tamur has to have exactly two. Okay, so for the Elfin stream, so please share with your channel. I hope we all had fun. I had, I hope you also had fun. So for the Elfin stream, so please share with your channel, especially in Club 987 members. Thank you very, very much. Six three more members that I will do tournament. 1000 members. Thank you will be very, very happy. And thank you for watching your channel and doing the channel. Thank Please hit the button and answer right here in this comments video and please share your chest and, and also please your digital please in the description. Yeah, bye bye, bye bye, guys. See you soon. See you tomorrow. And I'll see you in the next video.